I know what you're thinking, right? This dude crazy! Looks like someone went over the limit. Afternoon! Welcome to the spot! If you've been so kind, has been so humble to have uh, visited my humble abode, you know where we're at right now. This is the Garden of Dreams. Well, really it's not looking too dreamy right now due to the, um, the weather and the change of seasons, but you know how that goes. So today, um, we're gonna be taking a look at some of this really cool stuff here that I have. Really, the art is just for all background. Don't worry about the art. We're just chilling today. And um, I have a challenge for you all today. Um, you can guess what kind of tea I'm drinking. I'll give you a fee piece of art. So let's go, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, ooh. <coughs> you know, but um, overall, really I just wanna take the time to just give thanks and praise to everybody for checking this out. Thank you for hanging out. Um, really, and he hooked me up with these sick, sick, sick wood cuts or laser cut burns. Uh, so you know how we do it here. We collaborate with a lot of bands, musicians, artists, and DJs. And, um, you know, so we put this lineup together. He just came through town not too long ago. It was actually quite a while ago. Duh, don't quote me on that. Time is kind of a uh, uh, construct for me, so I often forget. What time is? But, uh, yeah, so... Um... Huge shout out to that. If you stopped by the house, you might have got one for free. Or if you bought one of these pieces, you know, you probably got one in the mail. Or you're going to get one real soon. You know, so I'm really giving, man, and I just want to share my love with all you all, so I appreciate that very much. Um, last but not least, I want to take the time to give a shout out to, uh, to Generals. Generals Bar and Grill Restaurant, downtown Shreveport in the, uh, in the Red River District. I was blessed with this amazing opportunity, right? And I uh, and just want to go ahead and say this video is sponsored by our sponsor by today, Yo Mama. Looks like someone went over the limit. But um, I'm working on a manga. Yeah, I'm working on a manga, I'm working on a comic book. Well, actually, so I've been digging through the archives, right? And I found a lot of my old pieces of work, of material. In fact, there's so much, there's so much story in here that like, this is, this is just book two. No, this is just book two right here. This is book two, Look how thick that is. So we got book two, we have book three, we also have book one in here as well. And I was also able to find a side story that I worked on that deals with something. First chapter is gonna be a one shot. I'm gonna make it like super kind of like engaging for people to check out. But if you wanna buy the volumes after that, I mean, if you wanna read the volumes after that, I might open a webtoon or something, but I might just um, put all my um, comments on my website so that you can just check out each volume as it comes out if you're into that kind of thing. Uh, so yeah, uh, it's super tight. I really love this story. And I've been thinking about getting back into the uh, manga comic scene for quite some time. And I think this would be a good way to get started into it because I was so dedicated to the story. If you're an OG fan of mine, you know you know how long I've been working on this. In fact, there was a, there was a fire. There was a fire, yeah. I was gonna say something about there's a fire, but <laughs> There was an actual fire that happened back in 2010. And I left my manga at a friend's house. I'm telling you, I had the full volume, the whole series, everything just done. The house burned down, y'all. So, um, so that, you, you know how that goes. But uh, yeah, uh, manga coming out, um, woodcuts, sick art, uh, some cool drywall piece we're not gonna talk about. I have a video game right now that's out in beta. If you want to know about it, uh, feel free to send me a message or something. You can play test it for me. I need to play test it. I actually I have a full Discord uh, community that's already doing that for me, so um, I don't really need that much help. But um, overall, yeah, guys. Um, ultimately, my goal is just to keep creating while I'm here in this city. I do plan to make a move at some point. I'm not going to tell anybody where I'm going to move because I don't like my plans to fall apart. What I'm doing is just like to hang out with your boy, whether I'm in public or not. I'm always on that Telegram channel, guys. So uh, I'm gonna give you guys a Telegram channel link if you, if you, if you like to have it. And uh, that's it, guys. Um, thank you all for hanging out with me. And uh, it's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure. Um, stay beautiful. Stay crafty. Love your faces. Juices. Looks like someone went over the limit.
also want to give a shout out to everybody that's ever contributed to Chuck's Grab, that's ever bought a piece of art, that's come and seen me at Bears Fest this year. Shout out to Colton Johnson and his wife as well. Appreciate y'all for getting married. Super excited about that. I give thanks to, uh, to Bears as a whole for hosting me. Um, also, I just give thanks to, uh, to Algorand and Dark Room Gallery for hosting my art on the virtual art gallery this year that we have. It's my first gallery ever. You know me, dude. I don't like to do galleries. I don't really like doing that whole, like, you know, mainstream route. I prefer to do it the low brow way. Just getting in people's faces and getting to meet them, getting to know them. I'm a very family guy, so uh, I thought that was really cool doing my first virtual gallery. Uh, do shout out to all the uh, the blockchains that have reached out to us, you know, for hosting our art, uh, whether, you know, from Zillica, the Zillica family, we go by Zill fam on, on Twitter. So do shout out to those guys. I just want to give a shout out also to uh, Voodoo Tattoo and the 13 Daggers. Great family, guys, like amazing, great family. We traded stickers. We hung out at Jazz and Blues Festival this year. It was super tight, man. It was a lot of love. It was so much love, dude. Uh, so much love. You know, and the shout out to, to Hillary Frazier as well for being a great ambassador for Renzi, Renzi Student Arts Education, being a great friend, and just being an awesome ball of sunshine. Huge shout out to my boy Floyd, AKA Ben Moss. One of the most prolific uh, street artists that I know here in Shreveport. And so just a great ball of sunshine, man. These people are freaking awesome, man. Give them some love, give them a thanks, a praise, applause, and above and beyond, okay. All right, so before we go any further, I decided to keep this real short. I love, um, I love tea, by the way, so use, use tea head. Um, uh, also, I know we've been giving a lot of shout outs. We've given a lot of shout outs. But also, I cannot forget, I cannot forget my boy uh, at Dragonfire Arts. A lot of us know him as Puckett. He's a floor arts instructor based out of Dallas, Fort Worth. He's done a lot of traveling around throughout these years. 